What's up guys? I'm out here in Mac Groveland, close to the St. Thomas neighborhood, looking at one of my favorite types of deals. This is the 1950s major cosmetic job with unfinished basement space. So check this place out. It's just dirty and gross enough to scare away plenty of buyers. Looks like there was a fire there. Um, you can see just big cosmetic jobs everywhere you look. We're in the one bedroom unit. Going down to the basement. So just to get the lay of the land here, we go up this to the north unit, which is a one bedroom. We go up this staircase to the south, which is a two. Now, what most city inspectors are gonna wanna see is known as continuity. You can't have any um, shared space between units. You know, if this guy's coming down in his pajamas at 2 a.m. and he runs into this lady, that's not good. People want privacy. So the first thing you're gonna wanna do is talk to a contractor, talk to the city inspector. What can we do about this wall? How can we increase this so that each unit has privacy? But now you're gonna see all the potential. Once you can get over that hurdle, we've got the ceiling height. We got an old gravity furnace that's gonna scare away a lot of buyers. Uh, but if you occupy, the city is gonna finance a brand new one with great loan terms for 10 years. Um, here, you know, all in all, this property probably has an extra 750 unused square footage down here. The best bang for your buck when it comes to building equity is finishing square footage. And a lot of the job is already done here. You know, a lot of these rooms are already framed out. Um, it's really dry down here. This place was built in the 50s. So for St. Paul standards, it's fairly new. Now we're on the south side unit, currently a two bedroom. Uh, you can see these 50s places that are just ass ugly and just intimidating enough to scare away plenty of buyers or sometimes the best deals. You know, check out this bathroom. It's down at the subfloor in the corner. There's no toilet. But for anyone who's halfway competent in, you know, surface level basic construction, this is the kind of deal you want to look for. The location couldn't be better. You know, we are in an A-class neighborhood surrounded by really, really beautiful homes. Uh, there's three private colleges in this neighborhood. It's never going to be hard to find tenants. This place is priced at 300 k uh, If you were going to pay someone to do all this work, including finishing the basement, you could, you know, potentially be 80, 90 deep but I'm gonna assume the value after rehab is gonna be in the mid 400s. So pretty good return on investment.